This is animal print. This is the 1930s. This is Tarzan, the ape man. This is the audience loving it, loving animal print costumes. This is mass production. The 1950s, where Betty Page made leopard print sultry and Christian Dior made it high fashion. The 60s, where bikers and hippies of the wild and free movement took animal print and made it all their own. The 70s, where punk rock remade it into a sexy rebellious statement. The 1980s, the era of excess. This is the 90s. This is the 2000s. This is animal print, and this is you. Every generation finds their own way to make animal prints work. They can be on sporty tops, layered up as a dress, on a blazer for the office, on a pair of boots, or even just as a go-to top and a pair of slacks. The important thing to keep in mind is not to dominate the outfit with it. Stick to one or two general statement pieces and you'll be fine. Also, while we're on the topic of animals, Strawberry Leopard is incredibly passionate about wildlife conservation. We proudly support the Wildlife Conservation Society to help save wildlife and wildlife places. One dollar per purchase price of each bottle of Strawberry Leopard's semi-permanent conditioning hair color sold will go directly to WCS.